So going back from modulus argument form to Cartesian form is much more straightforward because I can type these directly into my calculator. So all I need to do is just do three lots of cosine of pi over 2. So three lots of cosine pi over 2. Make sure your calculator is in radians, of course, and you get 0. Okay, and then you've got three lots of sine of pi over 2, which is 3. So it's just 3i for that first one. The second one, 8 times cosine of pi over 6 is 4 root 3. And then 8 lots of sine of pi over 6 is 4. So we get 4 root 3 plus 4i for number 2. Number 3, 5 times cosine of minus pi over 3 is 5 halves. And then we get 5 times sine of uh, minus pi over 3, which is minus 5 halves root 3i. Don't forget the i. <clears throat> And then finally, uh, 2 times cosine of minus 3. So I'm going to write these uh, to 3 sig fig. So minus 1.98. And then uh, 2 times sine of minus 3 is minus 0.282. So take away 0.282i to 3 sig fig. OK, so all you're doing is you can write it straight into your calculator, multiply it out, and then you've got it in Cartesian form as required.